morning everyone, Morena here from Auckland. I am Abhinav, one of the international student ambassadors at the University of Auckland. And I reside at the Waikwanga House, which is one of the many options available at the University of Auckland for accommodation. Did you know that the University offers more than 12 different options for accommodation and you can choose between catered and self-catered options to suit your needs. It's a great place to be in. I'll see you in the next video. Hey guys, I'm just at home right now. I'm about to head into campus to go for a workout at the university gym and I'll show you my walk there and um, some of the ways that I spend my days here in Auckland. Hope you like the video. So this is the way that I walk to the university's gym and rec center uh, from the city campus. It's about a 10 minute walk from the general library and it's super easy. That big park that you can see across from me is called the Auckland Domain. There's lots of green spaces if you wanna have a picnic with your friends or just do some exercising in the park. Um, and it's really great to be there. And just further ahead there, that's deeper into the park. So as you can see, it's a really easy walk um, from the university to the gym. It's super convenient to get to. Um, and you see lots of people walking back and forth during the day. Um, we're trying to just go to the gym to get some exercise. There's you know, fitness classes like Pilates or cycling, um, free weights and machines. And the place that I'm going to is actually up on the second floor. Um, there's a separate studio up there with some circuit machines, uh, cardio machines, um, and some floor space if you wanted to do some floor workouts. So the university runs a women's only fitness session twice a week, uh, which is what I'm going to today. It's really great because there's an instructor who will show us how to use the machines, run through different workout and trainings with us, um, so you can get some really good advice about any questions that we might have about fitness and exercise, and it's just a really good environment to do workout. So after I work out in the gym, I like to go to Albert Park, which is right next to the city campus. As you can see, it's super green. Um, it's really popular with students and staff to just go there to have lunch or have a short walk. Um, it's like a five minute walk from most university buildings. And you can see it's autumn here. All the leaves are on the ground and the leaves are changing colors. It's just a really nice um, place. Sometimes I go here and video call my family and friends from back home. Um, and it's just, yeah, a really great place, as you can see. So this uh, path I'm on actually leads down into the city, and um, I'm going to go to a bakery called Scarecrow, which I really like to pick up some fresh bread that I'll be able to use for my breakfast tomorrow. Um, and it's just, yeah, so convenient to get into the city from the university. Time to get some bread. So I'm just picking up um, an iced coffee from a local coffee shop and then I'm gonna head home. Now I'm back home. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing a little look into how I spend my days here in Auckland. As you saw, uh, I went for a workout at the gym and then a really nice walk through Albert Park, which is right next to Auckland City Campus. After that, I stopped by Scarecrow Cafe to pick up some bread for my breakfast tomorrow. And then I grabbed a nice coffee from my favorite coffee shop and it's time for me to get back to my studying. So thanks for watching. favorite study spots in uni and these are really great places to get your things done to catch up with any assignments or lectures and even meet up with some friends so yeah come check it out okay firstly i'd like to apologize for my poor video taking skills but yeah, as you can see i'm just taking the stairs here and this is to the university library and the reason i'd like to study here is because it's really quiet and it's a very comfortable place Alright, so next up we have the University of Auckland Business School, or as we call it, the OGGB. And so I'm going here to study in one of the computer labs and to get my assignments done. And so this is the way I take, I just take these stairs to go down and the computer labs should just be right over here. So this is what a typical desk looks like in one of the computer labs. And yeah, you have the monitor, keyboard and mouse and pretty much everything you need to get your work done. So after a whole morning filled with studying, it is now time to have a break and go get some lunch. 
As you can see, this is just some of the range of food that are available to purchase at the university. Personally, I prefer to bring my own food to save cost, but I do buy food sometimes. And so as you can see to your left, this is where I'd normally eat my food and just have a nice chat with some of my friends. Hi guys, so uh, I just finished my work at the Student Contact Center and now it's 5 o'clock and now I'm planning to go to the uh, society meeting. We usually have like meeting every Friday and because this week we will have an activity coming up so I have to do one more meeting before the actual big <laughs> It's Abhinav here again and I am in my kitchen at the Waikonga house and this is our fridge magnet collection here and this is my wife Prathna and the meal for the evening is this wonderful chicken and spinach curry looking forward to having that soon um, hope you've liked the video that we have made for you uh, we hope that it gave you a glimpse of what it is to be a student at the University of Auckland. Uh, please do contact us if you have any questions. We are available to the University of Auckland International Student page. And uh, cheers. See you. Bye.